Good day, Crypto Cyborg here, bringing you bits and bytes of crypto. So feel free to share, like and subscribe on the video below, please guys. And uh, also comment on uh, what I bring you. Okay, today we're going to have a look at, uh, at Luna and what it's all about and why you should have a look at investing in this specific cryptocurrency. So why did Luna beat Bitcoin? Okay, Luna grew over 14,700% in 2021. So ask yourself three questions before making an investment. What does this company offer that the others don't? Is this company showing growth and interest in its product? What problem does it solve and how big is the market for this problem? Okay, so what are Terra and Luna? The Terra network, it consists of two. The Terra network is a cryptocurrency that is different to Bitcoin, but similar in functionality to Ethereum, Cardano, and Solana. Bitcoin is a hybrid digital payment system and digital gold investment option. Ethereum, Cardano, and Solana, on the other hand, are no smart contract enabled cryptocurrencies. Unlike Bitcoin, these cryptocurrencies enable applications to be built on top of their blockchain networks, just like you have different apps that run on your mobile phone's operating system. So the Terra network with its native cryptocurrency Luna is also a smart contract enabled crypto, but what separates it from others is that it has a different focus. If you look at Terra like a company, it could be seen as a mix of a bank and payments network like Visa that aims to make banking and payments cheaper and faster. So Terra's network over the past year of 2021, as can be seen here, in fact, a thousand dollars investment in Luna would have translated into $147,692 over the past 12 months. This return on investment is over 240 times greater than Bitcoin. Bitcoin would have only given you $1,594 over the same period. So lunar market cap is worth 20 billion US dollars. So calendar returns, as you can see here, yeah, 14,769 versus 265 and 59 of Ethereum and Bitcoin. Astonishing returns. So what's driving the value? So Terra Network is one of the leading smart contract enabled blockchain networks aiming to rebuild the slow and expensive payment system that we have today. Terra does this through the creation and transfer of stable coins. The stable coins are simply cryptocurrencies that are pegged to conventional government backed currencies, such as the US dollar. The Terra blockchain network allows its users to spend, save, trade, or exchange these stable coins instantly. All of this can be done on a Terra blockchain without a need for any banks or financial intermediaries. You can think of investment in Terra like, investment, like investing in a basket of fintech and banking apps, each with its specific use case and potential customer. Rather than having ownership of one app, you have the chance to own the, fun the foundational application layer that runs the most successful fintech apps. That number of applications could grow as much as developers are willing to build on Terra's network. So here are the factors that drove Luna's returns in 2021. The significant technology developments of the Terra network that improve scalability and funct functionality. Over 70 newly confirmed projects are set to build on Terra this year which is one of the largest pipelines in the crypto blockchain space, the potential of the Terra network to win over the market share of a very large market. So what is Luna? Luna is the Terra protocol's native crypto and one of the top 10 cryptos by market cap. The Luna token serves two purposes, to create and stabilize the price of stable coins on the protocol and to give its holders governments governance rights over how the network is run. By focusing on stable coins, the Terra protocol has made financial applications very efficient. This, as a result, has amassed billions of dollars in value. 
Terra user can send money to one another in a matter of seconds, earn interest on their savings and even take out a loan. So should I buy Luna? You need to ask yourself what problems being solved is Terra seeing adoption and how big the market is it aims to disrupt. So the Terra network is making the global payment system more efficient. Terra blockchain can handle over 10,000 transactions per second at near zero cost, even on weekends. Visa, which process 1,700 transactions per second, only transacts on weekends and costs over 100 times as much. Seeing explosive growth, even though Terra is still relatively new, it has amassed vast amounts of value. Terra's Chai payment system has 2 million users and according to Terra's website, processes more than $1 billion in transactions each year. Further growth potential, the global fintech market and payment sector is valued at $160 billion and is expected to grow to $310 billion at an annual growth rate of 24% to 2025. Stablecoins which Terra, which Terra enables through its blockchain network have opened a multi-trillion dollar opportunity in the payment and finance space and have seen growth from $5 million to $170 billion in supply. Terra stablecoins could achieve a 20% market share by 2025 from less than 8% currently. So there you have the facts, guys. Um, Overall, looking at very stable coin, it's got places to go and it's definitely worth investing in. Just a short one, I hope it was um, informative. That's all for now. Have a great day. Cyborg signing out.